Welcome back to another episode of Danny Stone Outdoors. This is an episode that I've been wanting to make for a long, long time. Because a good friend of mine, I've been trying to get in touch with him and try to work it out where we can go fishing together. But our schedules never seem to jive between work and different, just different things happening in life. We just never could. But finally, the stars aligned and the moon and the sun was in the right place. And today, we are going fishing with the man himself, Mr. Richard Cluck, from Fishing and Freedom. That's right. We're going to hit the riverbank with Fishing and Freedom. So, watch this video. I'm going to stop off real quick and you'll go for about a minute or so and catch some bait. And we're going to go after it and see what happens. Uh, he's on here all the time. Matter of fact, the last two shows I put out, he was on both of them. And he caught the, we were down there at Portsville. He caught a nice little chuff cat there. Oh, okay. They did a, we were fishing north to Austin's Point. Uh, there's one. There's one right there. That's what I was looking for. Come on. These things are hard to get in, though. Because they got the hook. There he is. All right, I need a couple more of them. Skip Jack. I've got a bunch of frozen ones, but I need some fresh ones. Hey! Four inch skipjack! <laughs> yeah, that's no four inch one! Little bit skipjack! Alright, we've got the bait. Let's go hook up with Richard and see if we can't get on some of them big old catfish. Y'all watch this. You're going to love it. I just had a little one bang on that rod real hard. That there, he banged on it real hard like that. Yeah, there wasn't no stick, so. Oh, he's still taking drag. Yeah, he's still taking drag. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna tighten drag down on him. I was just about to say give up on this spot. All right, we're over here back to Mississippi River. Fishing with the man himself, Mr. Richard Cluck from Fishing and Freedom. And we just hooked into something. Man, he is running downstream toward you big time. I think I saw his tail come out of the water underneath your rods. Now what's it out there? Is that him? Man, he's on I may have to come over you. I may have to come over you because uh he's got me down there away where you are. Let me see where exactly where he's at. All right. 
right, cold day cats. We got the skunk off of it. Nice little blue. And he hit the way I like him to hit. Grab it and go. Let's get the camera turned around here. We'll turn the loose back in the water. I'm going to turn it loose right over there. There he is. Yeah, we got the skunk off of it. There we go. You're going the wrong way, son. That way. That way. There he goes. All right, that's what I'm talking about. All right, it's day two and we're back at it again. Same spot, we're going after them big catfish that we missed yesterday. But we're not playing today. We brought out the big guns and we brought out the big rods. When I'm talking about the big rods, I'm throwing out the Akuma 13 footer and the 15 foot power plus uh, angler up. And we brought out the big guns with us today. We got real gal with us. We ain't playing. There they are, fishing in freedom and real gal. If you can't catch fish, you bring this crew in. I guarantee you're gonna make a difference. Let's get some rods in the water and get, make something happen. All right, we've got lines out in the water and we are fishing. If you, I don't know if you can see them over that, right around that hump right there. You see them rods sticking up. That is uh, fishing and freedom, Richard Club, and real gal. So real gal and fishing and freedom. They're fishing just the other side of this point from me right here. There's a uh, an eddy that's swirling around right there, and they're working that eddy. That's where we lost that big catfish yesterday. I'm hoping they get on that, and we get to see that fish today, and I can get my hook back. But we got the rods out. We're fishing. Let's see if we can catch some fish. Fish on! Big fish on! On the, on the 15 footer! Oh man, it's a good one! He slammed the crap out of it! Fish. I got the oh <laughs> I got banged on that Akuma real hard right before this one bent. <sighs> oh he's heavy. Get that head. Y'all sitting there watching that Akuma cause something banged it. And uh I started walking toward it and this one here buckled over. Oh yeah. He looks like pretty good. Oh yeah. Oh, he's oh. taking drag too, ain't he? he? Yeah, he's taking drag, but he's getting he's getting all up in my other lines, but that's fine. Uh, I think I'm about to chase him down. Because he's crossing another line. This is good fish. And what sucks is I'm live and nobody's watching. <laughs> I got zero freaking viewers. Oh man, look at him run, look at him run. Oh. Oh man. This gonna be a good fish. Man, I mean, I don't know, pussy putting around. He just slammed it. Yeah, I'm trying to keep him in between these two right here. Oh. I got the drag tightened down and putting all I can on him. Oh crap, they're gonna take a drag, take a drag. Oh yeah. He's a good one. Oh yeah. Look at that tail, did you see that? Mm -hmm. pretty good one, boy. Oh crap. Man, I better get this rod on the other side of my uh, family jokes. Man, I, I can't even pull him up right now. He's holding me right there. Oh, has he got me around something? I'm not sure. I hope he don't. Because I can't move him. 
Trip right there, son. 30, 40, 40. I ain't got my freaking scales with me. You got scales? Me. And uh, I'm live on live video on YouTube, but ain't nobody watching. I can go back and watch. Hey, your other rod just laid right there, too, dude. Okay. Man, look at the knot on his head there. For all y'all that's not watching live, look what you missed. Oh, let me get a hold of them. Oh, look at there. Whoo! That's what I'm talking about. Look at that catfish. Cold weather cats, he got a boo-boo on his head. Man, we're going down here to see Richard and get a weight on him. Oh, Lord. Look at that in there. That's going to be, it may be the best fish this year, I don't know. Oh. That one was fun. All right, I'm waiting on Richard getting out of those scales. We're going to get a weight on him. And then we'll get him back in the water. Well, I'm freaking winded. Yeah, I bet. And uh, that's all. Uh, I've got I've got one other skipjack left. That's a fresh one. This was actually an old rotten one that was half a skipjack. Really? Yeah, it's an old rotten skipjack. Huh. Yeah, the head on him was uh. Let's just say it was less than fresh. Yeah. But yeah, man, I got that, that Akuma. It went like this, man. It went straight down and come back up. Huh. And I thought, crap, he didn't hook up. And I started walking toward it when I did. Uh, he probably smoked this one. Mm. Caught him right up there. <laughs> <laughs> and thank God I had the drag loose and dunk because as soon as he hit man he was he was pulling he's, he'll go he's in 30s if not 40s oh he's at least 30. oh he's, yeah he's at least 30. i'd say mid upper 30. Mm. well we're gonna get away on him yeah, big... yeah he bit the shit out of me a while ago i'm scared to stick my hand in his mouth again he's clamped down he said uh, he said, you ain't putting nothing else in my mouth. Yeah, all zeroed out. Yeah. Push and hold that hold. All right, you ready for this? Uh, oh, good Lord, I thought that fish away morning. I figured he was easy, 30. Yeah. It's showing 2412. I'd say he's bigger than that. I think so. Alright. Well, I think I'm gonna. He won't let you go your scales, man. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna, I'm gonna walk him down here and let real be all seen, and then we'll get him loose. You know, that's weird. The last fish, last blue I weighed with him, it said 2412. Huh. I wonder if him scales ain't. That's good. Man, I know he's gotta he's, be 30. 
I was guessing high thirties almost. Yeah. Four. He's got to be in the thirties. All right, Greg's all loosened, so if anything gets in there, it's gone. It's not gonna steal early. Zero this out. Yeah, listen to that low grunt. Mm -hmm. Sound like a big buck. Mm -hmm. Let's try it one more time. Okay. Yeah, we're going to 25-10. Man, he locked in 25-10. Well, we're going to call him 25-10 then. I don't want nobody singing our teeth on him. But I would have said 30 on him all day long. Me too. All right. Let's go ahead and see what else. She didn't want to walk over all these rocks. Oh, no, I want to see it. That was a good fish. Alright. For all y'all that wasn't watching, you just missed a massive catfish. I mean, massive. I just released him down there. But we got video footage on here, and I've got the camera running over here. We just caught a massive catfish. Now, Richard's scales were showing 2510 on it. But we're going to calibrate them and check them because, I mean, I'll tell you what, that fish felt a lot heavier than that. But we're going to call it 2510 because that's what the scale says until we can confirm the scale is wrong. But that was a great takedown on a fish right there. You got to admit, that was a great episode. How about that catfish at the end of it? And I talked to Richard. I told him that, man, I'm more than willing. Anytime he wants to go fishing and we'll collaborate with our channels. But don't forget... Go check out his channel, Fishing in Freedom. It's Fishing and the letter N and Freedom. And also check out Real Gals channel. So go check out their channels. Hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up. Let them know a comment down there that Danny Stone sent you. Alright? We're heading to the Deer Woods next. We're leaving out the day after tomorrow. And we're going to try to get some videos up there of some awesome deer hunting. We're going to shoot some videos of deers that we're not going to shoot. And we'll try to get a shot on a video of a deer that we do want to shoot. But either way, we'll get plenty of footage for you of running around in the woods, checking out some critters, and maybe getting something good to bring home with us. I'm Danny Stone from Danny Stone Outdoors. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. God bless you, and we'll see you again real soon.